So I just received this magnifying glass light by Gaytar. So I just want to do a quick unboxing and go ahead and test this out to see how well it works. So this box just opens right up. And the first thing I see is going to be this thank you card. We're also going to have a quick instruction page. We got a cleaning wipe, the power adapter, magnifying glass stand, the clamp, and finally the base. And this thing is pretty hefty. And we also got foam at the bottom just to prevent it from scratching on the table. And then here's what the top piece looks like. And this is where the magnifying is going to go ahead and attach to. And there's like this little knob here too. So there's going to be two versions of this magnifying light. We can either clamp it to the desk or go ahead and use the base. And in this case, I want to clamp it first and then show you how it looks like on the base. So I went ahead and loosened this up. So now it fits right under here and I can go ahead and tighten this. And there, now it's nice and tight. And there also is going to be a foam piece right at the bottom here. And then same thing on this thread over here just to prevent it from basically just scratching uh, the table from the top or from the bottom. And now this can be placed right on top and as you see it goes ahead and swivels and when the right position is found this little knob can be turned just tightening the light and now you can't move it as easy anymore. So I went ahead and adjusted this and it was really easy. This can go up, down and then same thing for the top part. It can swivel up and down and there's also going to be these knobs to go ahead and tighten it. Same thing for over here. And then of course, same thing all the way down here. I went ahead and loosened this just so I can move it freely a little bit easier. And now on the top part, this is where we're gonna have all the controls. So all these buttons are gonna be like capacitive touch. So that means you don't have to click them. You just kind of tap it and it turns on. So I press the power button and this goes ahead and lights up. I press it again, it turns off. Let me turn it back on. And now we're gonna have the plus and minus and that's gonna go ahead and control the intensity, the brightness. So right here is the brightest you see. So if I tap it, nothing happens. And if I dim it, I get one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, so nine different options. So this is gonna be the dimmest setting. And then let me go back to the highest setting just so you can kind of see the difference in there. Now the other thing we can change is gonna be the color temperature, which is gonna be dictated by M. So that's gonna be mode. And right here, we're gonna have uh, basically like white light. And as I change it here, you can go ahead and see it turns a little bit cooler and it turns yellow and it goes ahead and repeats that. And there's gonna be five different modes. And here we could see the lowest, and here we could see the lowest temperature is 3000 Kelvin, which is gonna be the yellow light right over here. And it goes all the way up to 6,500 Kelvin or otherwise more like a blue light right over here. And so now if I wanna go ahead and change it to the base, it's gonna be real simple. Just loosen this up and it comes right off. Put the base down, insert it in, loosen this a little bit. It goes all the way down and then I can go ahead and screw it in. And there. And now this light can extend really high up. So as you see, it gets really tall. And then here I can go ahead and adjust this a little bit more too. And there and here it gets really high up that it almost touches this over here. But this is going to be too tall for me because I don't want to use it for something big. Right now I just want to use it for something really small, which is going to be this quarter. So I took the magnifying glass off the stand and I put it back on the clamp just because this gets lowered to the ground here. And so now time for the quarter. So just like an overhead shot. Here you can see this is what the quarter looks like and let me get a little bit closer just so you can kind of see. So here's what the quarter looks like up close and if you can't see the letters then here's what it looks like with the magnifying glass. And of course it is kind of dark and that's where the light comes in. So let me let it get in focus and let me actually change this to more of a white light. So actually let me go yeah over here and there now it looks a lot clearer and then compared to before here's the after here's the before so it goes ahead and makes it about five times better. But we also have 10 times magnification with this little portion over here. So I'm actually gonna slide the quarter a little bit over. And wow, yeah, this, you can see a lot more detail. Now I can actually read United States of America. And if I move this a little bit over, here we can see Liberty, quarter dollar. And yeah, I might have to get a little bit closer to read that, but you might be able to tell on your screen and then here we could see, you know, a lot better details as opposed to over here or as opposed to over here. But let's take a look at something else. So right here are the instructions it comes with. So if you have trouble reading this, you know, here's what it looks like with the magnifying glass. And yeah, you could tell a difference, you know, like that. And now with a 10 times, yeah, this looks a lot better, a lot cleaner. Yeah, that looks really nice. This works really well. Uh, and again, if you want to go ahead and change the colors here, let me go ahead and change it so you can kind of see what they looks like. And if this is a little too bright, you know, I can also dim it. That's as dim as it gets. 
and then that's as bright as it gets. So overall, I'm pretty happy with this magnifying glass lamp. You know, if you don't want to use it as the magnifying glass, you can just simply prop it on top of your desk and just use it as a lamp. And the good thing is that this also swivels a lot. So not only can we go ahead and turn the head, you know, up and down, but this can also rotate a lot. Actually, yeah, it rotates 360 degrees, as you see here. And, you know, it can be adjusted in various ways because there's going to be, you know, one, two, three different knobs, counting the one all the way at the bottom. So there's a lot of adjustments that can be made. And it's pretty versatile because, you know, if you don't want to go ahead and clamp it to the desk, you also got the stand it comes with. So if you're looking for a magnifying glass lamp combo to either work on some electronics or just read, you know, tinier writing, definitely check this one out.